Gaucho's vlog. Herculaneum, stabile, tutto da greco e torre annunciata. Was disaster, why? Because Vulcano Vesuvio blew up after 400 years sleeping, ok? Like two ice Hiroshima boom. How people died, people have been suffocated, asphyxiated from the gas, sulfur gas, too hot. The last eruption, 1944, during the last World War, ok? It's always active, always dangerous, ok? So, when Pope has revealed, nobody knew about Volcano Vesuvius. All the population in this area think it was mantle. Okay? Talking about the 7th century BC, when uh, here was a small village. At that time, a lot of migration from north of Italy, Etruscans, just to go down here, the Greeks as well, and after the Romans arrived, uh, between the population from here, Etruscan Greeks and Romans, great battles. Of course, the winners, the Romans, but the town of Pompeii started to be built by the Greeks, 6th century BC, and they finished to be built by the Romans. So it was uh, the 5th century BC when Pompeii, the town of Pompeii, was finished to be built. When you see a big, large volcanic lava stone on the front of you, it's a Greek time. When you see these type of stones, small volcanic lava stones, Greek time, the Roman Empire. So Pompeii built near the sea. The sea was not far from this entrance. Now it's a two kilometers far. Why? Because it's a volcanic area. So level the sea go up and down, far and near. Maybe one day come back again here, okay? So the right place for import export to Africa, to Asia, to Orient, okay? Built near the sea, of course. Two fantastic rivers, the Sarn on the left, Serene on the right hand side. That time very important to collect the water for the town of Pompeii, and the water was very clean. Today is disgusting. Okay? So mixed population live in Pompeii. So we have uh, the Oshi population from this area, Etruscan Greeks, Romans, but later also Jewish people. Why? Very famous for business, import exports for the right place to be here. Okay? It's a fantastic business, okay? Many merchants. It was a Jewish community as well. In which years? Jewish. In which years? Uh, it was uh, about uh, Pompeii finished to be built 5th century BC, about the 4th uh, century BC. Okay? It was a Jewish community in Pompeii. And uh, uh, the life was fantastic, the business was okay, people very happy. Population, how many inhabitants before the disaster arrived? 10,000. Only 20,000 inhabitants. It was 66 acres okay, okay? And uh, 62 AD, a terrible earthquake destroyed the part of Pompeii, Herculaneum as well. Emperor from Roma, Vespasiano, Vespasian, sent money to rebuild the town. When the town of Pompeii as well was finished with, to be up, Volcano Vesuvio block. 17 years later. 79 AD, I was in August. 24 of August, the first explosion about 1, the second one the evening about 7. The second one, strong explosion. Explosion, 32 kilometers far, with lava outside, volcanic lava zones, and ashes. Ashes from here arrive as far as Istanbul, Egypt, with windy. Today the volcano we have in Iceland, okay, arrived to England, okay, to the north of Italy as well. So by that time no aeroplane. Okay, today we have the aeroplane, okay. And uh, was catastrophe. Pompeii was destroyed like Herculean, Stabio to the Greco and to the all buried. Okay? And uh, when has been excavated Pompeii, excavation started. The 18th century. The time of Spanish domination around this bay, okay? But when they found also Pompeii, a lot of archaeology fences disappear outside of Italy. When we have the unification of Italy, you know, with Joseph Garibaldi, Vittorio Emanuel, it's had to be much better. Imagine Pompeii was 66 acres, and it's called only 45, 46 acres. 20 more acres must be discovered. 
many students from all parts of the world come study here, work here, because they found more things. Okay? All the important archaeological findings found all around the of Naples, we keep at archaeological museum in Naples. You have the chance to go there, it's fantastic to say, okay? They still found more things. So now we start the tour from the sea gates, okay? This is uh, the sea gates, the sea was near, the most important gates of Pompeii. We have uh, other six gates possible to see, but there was another one we are not sure where to see. So now we walk up to the sea gates, two minutes, right on the top, after it's flat, then give you all information, okay? Original road, 2,000 years ago. Yeah, we woke up. Okay. <coughs> In the evening, it was dark. No electricity at all. The only way to see bed the street when you walk in the night, they cut the ice. Fantastic idea, eh? The night was dangerous. Because it was dark, it was noxious. By that time we were not yet Christian, no Catholic. We're different to today. Basilicus, the time of the Roman Empire. Greek time, Basilea. Who does mean Basile Basilea? It was the court here, the justice, the president. Okay? Because we were not yet Catholic. We started to be Catholic, the 4th century AD, time on Peter Constantine. So this was also the right place to uh, meet business people from Africa, from Asia, from Orient. It was like a little Wall Street, okay? The 30% of the population in Pompeii slaves. Pompeii. Basilica was destroyed, uh, and you can see only part, okay? Possible to reach up the first level by steps from the left, from the right. Uh, the walk around was possible, okay, with another level. And in the middle was open like today. In the middle, we have the water system because before the accident, they used to collect the raining water. So sometimes three, four months, not raining at all, and they need water for the population. And to have the water always clean, what they put inside the water, eels, fish, the clean the dust, insect, and the water was always clean. You like eels? It's good for the heart. I had a little sweet water. I don't like. Why? Because I saw my father killing a eel, cut the head, left in the kitchen, go around. <laughs> anyway, the idea of the basilica, uh, fantastic decoration with a lovely, beautiful column. We have the Gorinthian style, Ionic and Gorinthian together, we call composite. Okay? And the in perspective, the lovely, beautiful column look like a marble. It's not. It's a plaster. At the imitation of Barbara. Okay? Plaster. Fantastic. The marble is down below. It was a lovely, beautiful column in the middle. It was marble. The base, the base is marble. Show another bottom thing. Before the sea was there. Now the sea is two kilometers far. Next town is Stadia. Also, Stadia was destroyed by terrible eruption in 79 AD. Very famous Stadia because was the place uh, was the place where Plinius, the older, he died. Plinius, he was an admiral. He was here before the terrible disaster arrived, when it started shaking and the lava started going down. I sent a letter to the nephew that he was in Capo Miseno near Naples. Okay, and the letter. Uh, the end has been sent to Tacitus, poet brothers. From this letter today it's possible to see Pompeii. Also Plinius, the older, he tried to run away, escape away with boat, rowboat, tried to go to Herculane, Naples, the other side, but the sea was terribly rough and uh, has been sent down to Stabia and he died so for this gas. Stabia take a name from Stabis. What does it mean in Latin, Stabis? A stable. Stable of horses. Coming from Naples, go to Stabia, after 28 kilometers, you need a new horse to go to Sorrento or via Malpicosta.